What's up guys, I'm at the channel. What, what I'm doing today is nothing much. I'm just gonna start doing these little vlogs. Kind of, so you guys get to know me a little bit, cause I did. In the video, it's kind of just me doing things. It's not really you guys know me, besides I'm doing things car related. That's really it, but. So my name's actually Sean. It's a Shadow Wado here, my name's Shadow. She's a little, she's a Siberian Husky, but she's a very stubborn Siberian Husky and very pain in my butt, so. But other than that, what we're doing today is I'm just gonna be, actually, I just got done editing a video for, um, let's see, this is my, the st stats and stuff like that for Social Blade. Um, but this is, uh, how explosive is stored gasoline? So, I'm a, that video's coming out, that'd be about before this video, of course. So, that's why it's not published, I have to go out, but. I just got a delivery here. This is a uh, new food for Shadow Wado over there. So we've been feeding her the Blue Wilderness stuff and, yeah, I'll give you an example. She doesn't eat it. So, I was trying to find another way. I think raw food or just like, you know, a different type of food that's not more natural, she'd be a lot better with. So, what I got here is something called Stay Lab. It's made in America. So, I don't know what's <laughs> exactly in this box. I believe I got her a chicken recipe. So welcome to stay. Make sure I don't have any address on this thing because we don't want you guys seeing the address. So um, I got that. So what we got here, we got a chicken recipe with butternut squash and carrots, 16 ounce cups. I think there's 17, yeah, 17 cups of it. A scale and a, a small cooler box. I guess that's my little small cooler box there. Um, so this thing came with the $47. <coughs> Sorry about my cough. My cough is from just, I don't know, ever since I got sick like a month ago. I just, a month of this cough. It's not a cough. It's just, I feel something coming up, so I cough. I don't have to cough, but I do. But, um, but yeah, it was, half, it was half off, so I got it for her. Hopefully it does something for her. Um, like I said, she just, she's such a stubborn eater. She loves our food. The problem is, is she, she's picky with food. And, you know, I, it's expensive to feed her chicken. I wouldn't mind cooking her, cook, cooking her chicken every night or giving her a piece of raw, like, steak and stuff like that, but it's expensive to do. So, you know, until I get some stuff going, you know, I can't afford that right now. So for now, we're gonna see what the State Lab stuff is. It's kind of like that um, farmer doll kind of stuff. So, what we got here is, okay, so here's, I don't see a cooler box. So unless you're just talking about the box here, we call this a cooler box, but. So you guys got 16 ounces of these. Um, I don't know how much I got feed her though. They didn't really, oh, is this it right here? This is it right here, let's see how it works. Pop one container in the fridge to defrost and stick the rest in the freezer to, to lock in the freshness until needed. FYI, it takes 24 hours to defrost in the fridge. Okay. No containers should be defrosted and kept in the fridge for no longer than four days to ensure freshness. Wait. Oh, never mind. I, 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 I'm thinking, I think it said uh, freezer. All right. So, based on Shadow's unique needs and health goals, you sh you share with us, she, she requires 710 calories per day. This is equivalent to 19... 19.4 ounces, 551 grams daily. Use the kitchen scale we have provided you, which we have right over here. And uh, daily, use the scale, blah, 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 to portion it. So once uh, fed, she, so she needs 19.4 grams per day. So we need to feed her 9.7 grams per day. And if I want to feed her three times a day, it's 6.5 ounces. So maybe some days I'll feed her three times a day, sometimes they're twice a day. Most of the time we do twice a day, because it's easier because, you know, feed her, go to work, come back, feed her. So most of the days I'm home. Then I, you know, feed her, maybe I feed her three times a day that day. So, all right. So I guess I'm just going to go get this stuff in the freezer, put one in the uh, fridge and stuff like that. And, you know, hopefully if I, I probably won't be able to feed her tonight, but tomorrow I'll feed her that in the morning. Yeah, Alright guys, I'm taking a shout out for a walk right now. I'm like it's an NG out of her, so I'm gonna try to run her a little bit. Because, oh, yeah, she is hyper right now. Alright, let's go, go. Oh, come on. Yep, I know, you can really pull me good. <laughs> Alright, girl. Not nighttime yet. I'm more of a nighttime runner, not more a morning or an afternoon runner. I'm more of a nighttime person. I can run a mile for at nighttime, but during the day, not so much. Yep. Gotta take a nice stroll through the woods. Run through the woods? Oh God! Jesus Christ! 
Alright, well you know what? No, I made the topic of the video is probably what's it like owning a Siberian husky? Hey get out of that needle that's needle. Get out of that. Not good. Oh, and she loves six. Um so we got her about like a, let's see, we got her back in August first. So almost three months now we've had her. Uh August no, August. <laughs> November first be three months with her. You know, she's awesome. When we first got her, she wasn't trained. She, <clears throat> yeah, she had no training. Whoever had, the people we had before did not train her at all. So, and anyone knows, Siberian Huskies are the most stubbornest dogs known to man. Everyone, anyone who's the only one knows that knows this. And when you put not training them, they become twice as stubborn and super independent. Very independent as it is. But then it, once you don't train them, they just come super independent, super stubborn, and train them as like dragging like a boulder, trying to drag a boulder through, I don't know, a string of sand, a, a desert. And it's just the sand's building up, and you're just like, Aah. So, but she was terrible. She just potty trained, took about a month. Um, two weeks, she was halfway there. Come on, let's go. Come here. Come here. Come on, we're going this way. Yeah, oh, oh, was that a spike bush you, you picked up? And that's why you threw it away? So. So, like I said, other than that, I would recommend Siberian Husky to any, oh, not anyone. If you have a lot of energy and you want, and you're okay with taking a bunch of walks, then, you know, they're gonna be crazy inside the house sometimes. She is kind of timid. They're not crazy all the time. Not, most of the time they're actually sleeping and laying around. But she will just come up to you with a toy and she will pounce on you until you start playing with her. So, if you want a Siberian Husky, look forward to that. Because they will just come up to you with a toy and they will pounce on you until you play with them. And it's kind of funny. It's cute. Except when you're doing something and really actually important or, you know, something like that. And they come pounce on you and you're like, I actually got to do this. I can't play with you right now. But, but no, I love it. I love her to death. Point and trade her. Wouldn't get rid of her. Maybe, maybe just wish I could maybe just put a sleeping dart in her butt sometimes just to calm her down, but can't do that. It's illegal. Well, it's not illegal. It's illegal, I believe. It's probably animal cruelty to do that to your pet dog. Not a while. Well, an animal probably not, but pet dog probably. Maybe if you just stop fighting. Oh, here you go again. What? Really? Really? You wanna go that way? No? Oh my god. No. Oh, you know, you're trying to get closer to the, I know, you're, you're trying to get closer to the dead animal. Come on, let's go. Ah! Oh, come on, let's go. You know, she might jump on me, probably. Watch. She might jump on me. Watch. I'm gonna try it. No, never mind. She just tried to jump on me. Oh my god. Oh. No, we're not going back that way. Get out of there. <laughs> you really think that's gonna work? Come on, let's go. Let's go. Well, she's gonna do it again, probably. Man, you're a bunker. You're really, she, and this is, this is kind of one of her hyper days. She's usually not this hyper. Really, it's actually not usually this hyper. But I think today she's been being cooped up in the house with me being home. So I was doing some editing on that video and I took a little bit to do. <laughs> really got her hyper, so so this is what I'm doing right now. But but yeah, guys. Other than that, I think I'm gonna end the video off here on this on this note here. I said I think tomorrow we'll do a little interview on the food. I'll do a separate video on that. But other than that, guys, like I said, I'm gonna start doing these little vlogs, kind of just get to know you know get to know me a little bit and you know get to know Shadow Addo here. <laughs> eventually, my my entire family eventually. You know, I want to see him more uh, evolved into this YouTube community. So, but uh, guys, let's see. Guys, enjoy the videos. Please leave a like down below, comment down below, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys next one.